everybody, welcome back to Random Lifestyle Vlog. Welcome to another episode with Abdul. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, as usual, we're going to unbox a look incredible and a cohorted oh, September boxes. Uh, oh my God, can you believe it's September already? I can't. I can't. October, November, December. It's almost Christmas. Christmas. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my God, but I feel it's like autumn, like the leaves are falling down and it's colder. So. Yeah, I mean, it's still warm-ish. I mean, um, yeah, like, like end of the summer is really nice. Today. Yeah, <laughs> uh, but yeah, I can also, like, I can actually, I mean, I don't know if you've noticed, but we changed some colors in here, so it's more Backdrops, like, lights, yeah, fairy really, lights, pillows, yeah. everything is so new. So it's like more like, you know, getting ready for and autumn, autumn winter autumn, vibes. Yes. Long nights with wild wine. wine. Okay, so <laughs> let's not bore people with more talking about like random wow, stuff. Let's it's so just heavy. open these. You want to start with cohorted then? Um, or do you want to start with looking incredible? Look incredible. Okay, so give me that one and yeah. Let's right, have a look. so because like the, the, the cohorted is so heavy, so let's, it is, oh, it is heavy, I think yeah. it's like a good one. So let's leave yeah. the good one for the rest for the for, for the end for the end. So we've got a look incredible and the box is like the same as it was on the previous oh, episode. Yes. Uh, it looks like a leather, it looks very nice and luxurious. Um, everything is the same. And the outside and inside. Oh, okay. I'll just take this little piece of paper. Piece of paper yeah. So the inside looks like this as usual, the same thing, but with some extras. So I've never seen that, what was it, in the wallet? This is Eve oh, Blossom no, and Purse. Back shell. And this is... Back shelf, I don't know. And uh, this is a free gift uh, that they included in this box, which is quite cool, but it's very, very pink. <laughs> Why sell beauty? I like yeah. pink, but this pink is not. It's pink. like a candy, uh, yeah, Barbie pink. I'll Barbie say. pink. But yeah. So it's like for some extra cosmetics and with like a mirror. So yeah. you can put like one lipstick maybe or Do you something. I think the lipstick will fit in here. I think maybe like a credit card. <laughs> so you can look how you're depressed when your money is just. <laughs> Going down from your bank yeah. account when you're spending. Yeah. <laughs> At least I, I look pretty. <laughs> I look pretty. I don't like the color, so yeah. are you going to use it? Don't know what I'm going to do with actually, that. Actually, it matches I mean, your, your green, so it looks that, nice. That's true. <laughs> that's true. I'm probably going to use it somehow uh, because, uh, yeah, I mean, it, the color is quite controversial, I would say. Uh, but other than that, yeah, it's nice. I mean, it, it's free, so it's like a nice touch to, to have like a freebie in here. So, yeah. Right, so we've got Delilah. Delilah. What is this? Color Intense Compact Power Powder Eyeshadow. And this one is uh, worth £20. The single is... eyeshadow. Okay. And this is full size. Yeah. And this is in the shade Biscuit 1608. That's actually. You know what? I mean, it looks okay. It looks actually quite pretty. I do I do prefer eyeshadow palettes than single eyeshadows, to be honest. I, I've never heard about this brand. I have heard about them because they feature quite a lot in uh, not maybe not sub subscription boxes, but advent calendars, I think. Uh, so yeah, that brand exists. I can assure you, but I don't really know much about it. I think I had like a brow um, pencil or something from from that brand before. Yeah. Right. So the packaging is cool. It looks like a matte metallic. Yeah. The packaging it doesn't leave it, it is shiny but it doesn't leave stains and your fingerprints which is quite cool because like it doesn't look cheap too and it doesn't look cheap it's quite heavy as well so yeah it looks, and it doesn't feel cheap looks too. nice <laughs> uh, when you open it I can feel there's like a magnet so it's not gonna mm. it's not gonna be loose and inside we've got what was the shade biscuit biscuit so it's like a burnt brown that's quite interesting. Dorky shade with the mirror inside. It's quite handy. Can, you, nice. can you swatch it closely? Yeah. Have a look. It is very, it is very powdery, so you need to be careful how you're gonna apply it. It's very intense. It is nice. Yeah, the pigmentation is nice. Yes. It's like a brown shade, a brownie, mm. quite brown. Yeah. Brown yeah, shade. but like a cold. Yeah, it's like a very warm brown. It's more like burnt brown. Yeah. Mm. It will match actually your your makeup today. Yeah. Yeah. Our yeah. makeup is nice today. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I'm learning. <laughs> yeah, I like the shade. It's really nice. It's like this autumn winter vibe, yeah. vibe-ish something. The shade is nice, as I mentioned. Did you had anything before. anything before from the brand? Yeah, yeah. I feel like an, I think a brow brow pencil or something like that. So not something I use that often, but 
yeah, as I mentioned before, I do prefer palettes, eyeshadow palettes, because it's easier for me. I mean, to like, you know, I have a palette and I just choose colors from the palette. Uh, I guess, I don't know, how do you, do you, do you prefer palettes or just single eyeshadows? Of your, I you prefer know, palettes. My, palettes, yeah. They kind of like make more sense. Like lots of makeup artists are creating their own, you've got like the empty yeah. palette for, with magnets so you can get the single individual kind of shadows sense, yeah. and just like put everything together. Yeah. And I'm like, me, yeah, can be palettes. Yeah. Rather spend like 20 pounds or whatever yeah. and get like a full size. And also like, you know, if you get a palette, sometimes you get colors that you wouldn't normally choose. But then if you have them, you're actually going to use yeah. them because it's like, oh, maybe I'll use this color. I mean, it, it's quite cool. So but yeah. This, but this one is actually, you can't take it out and put it like a single eyeshadow in like the set that you've got already. I don't know. It looks like it's more like a fixed thing, yeah. I think. Yeah. Well, what else do we have? So we've got... Um, uh, don't know. Marc Jacobs. Ooh, that looks uh -huh. nice though. That looks nice. I don't know what that is, but it looks this nice. This is Omega Bronze Co Coconut Perfect Tan Powder Bronze Ooh. in Cocoa. Fantastic. Ooh, okay. light like packaging. It's really nice and bougie bougie. This is worth thirty-eight pounds. Not bad for Marc Jacobs. Mm -hmm. Right. So, uh, white packaging, quite big and heavy. Oh yeah, yeah. It feels it feels nice. It feels nice. I mean. It looks like a tiny purse. Mm -hmm. So we press it and we open it. Da -da. Okay. Is it? Oh, yeah. All right. <laughs> wow, this is like a massive mirror. Massive mirror, yeah. <laughs> the bronzer is quite big too. Yeah. It doesn't smell of anything. It smells nice. Yeah, it actually does smell. I didn't really, I didn't really know why you, why you actually sniff it, but it smells nice. Some of the products where I was trying the the ones from Aldi, mm -hmm. the eyeshadow palette smells horrible. It's like a really it's just plastic. Did you did you end up buying this eyeshadow? Palette? I did buy. It. I yeah, did yeah. buy it. I, did, I haven't tried it yet, but okay. I just smelled. It. I was like, oh my god, this like smells like yeah. so chemical. This is nice. And try it. Yeah. I've never seen bronzer with the with the texture. Like yeah. this before. I think you have to switch to my skin for my... because it's your. Oh, this is my shade actually. Yeah. <laughs> fantastic. I'm fantastic. Okay. So yeah, that's the shade. Like a warm. Uh, it's not very dark. Uh, yeah, it's like a, a because I think it should just give you this um, like, a... like a look of like a, you know like you're all but like tan or something. So I think this is a little bit darker than my skin at the moment, so maybe it could actually like help me with the tan with you. Oh my it head, it looks like a bruise. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it's a little bit too, too light for you. Yeah, I guess. But I'm do you not, think if I, if I would put it on my face, would it be like, would it look like a... It would look like a probably like, like normal, like, like your normal skin, but like just more matte, I think. But I like the smell. I like the smell. Yeah, I like nice. the consistency. It's not dry and it's blending very nice as well. That's true. So I can I actually get how you actually can make like a fake tan with it, like you know, and not like a proper fake tan, but like you know, like you can just actually sculpt your face with yeah. this a little bit too, so it, it, it so gives it looks you this nice. natural, yeah. Or just give it like an extra warmth if you got like very light light yeah. foundation, just a yeah. warm up of your face. Uh -huh. mm, I like the mirror. It's very nice and clear, and it's like yeah. for the full size of the package, so it was really cool. Thirty. Eight pounds, thirty-eight. Mike Jacobs. Mm. Yeah, nice product. I, mm -hmm. I do like it. I like it. Yeah, not something I would buy probably by myself, but like that's why I like it. If I would get like as a, as a present or something, someone yeah. would recommend yeah, 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 yeah. it. I would like, yeah, sure, why not? Um, oh, Nars, hello, Nars. This is a lip liner, a precision lip liner, and. Don't know what kind of a shade, there's no name. The value is 19 pounds, that's what I'll mention from them. It's just red. red. <laughs> I think reds are gonna be cool now. Yeah. It, it is intense. It's intense. And it's like, a, it's not warm uh, red, it's more like, I would say, like um, intense red. Like it has blue know. undertone, yeah. so it's gonna match uh, loads of lipsticks Christian Louboutin lipstick, MAC lipsticks. Yeah, and this is like a, uh, I think, proper wintery, Christmassy red. It's yeah. not not like warm, red, spicy, red, red. no, red, but it's like, yeah. I Hold used to it. work for with the Norse products before. So, uh, yeah, this is like a really good liner. Yep. And the last, last one. but not least is Becca. This is Becca and Chrissy Tigan Lip Icing Glow Gloss Set, worth £20. 
That would be the second big brother, I think. But yeah. So we've got like a book, size of a book. Um, okay, I need to open it up here. So we've got one, two, three, four lip glosses. Yeah. And three are metallic or shimmery ones, and one is matte. I think that's okay. what I see. Okay, that's cool. That's a really nice uh, thing to get in a in a um, in a box, right? Because you get like you know proper four glosses in here, not just one. And yeah. Right. So pull out tab for an exclusive recipe from Chrissy. Okay. Oh, oh there's a recipe for like a Becca Boozy buns. Lipstick, uh, glasses and receipt. Okay. Never seen an idea like this before. Yeah, that's that's interesting. We I, can I turn on Thermomix and, and do it. Yeah, why not? <laughs> okay, so we right, have a recipe. So there is a tip, pro tip. Press on base of lip gloss to release... What? Press on base of oh, Probably to take it out you have to just press... Oh yeah, maybe something like that. And then you can... Uh... Okay, taking these out will actually take a while. But the pro tip doesn't really work as well as... Base is what base. Got it. Okay. Are we trying them on? Well, just try all of them. Yeah? Okay, yeah. let's go. So we've got... They don't have any names, do they? No, I don't think they do. I think it's Lip just... Icing Glow Gloss. Candy cane, right? This one is candy cane. I okay. Think. Okay, try it and I'll try to remove right. the other ones from the box. Just take them out. They don't smell. Oh my god, I've tried. Have you no, you haven't tried. Have you tried the new uh, Christian Louboutin lipstick? No. They've got 15 shades. Okay. And they're staining like hell. Really? Yeah. Oh, and Suku has new lipsticks as well. Oh really? I've never tried a Isuku lipstick. I've tried some... Um, okay, this looks like uh, fresh blood. <laughs> <laughs> Comparing to yeah, uh, yeah. Norse. This one is like much warmer, like a paprika. Like a yeah, like tomato. You know, yeah, tomato maybe, yeah. Right, so th the next one is... Fresh. Cinnamon bun. Okay, sounds delicious. Cinnamon bun. It would be nice if it would smell like cinnamon. No, it smells like a typical gloss. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this one is very like more like um, yeah, not not much pigmented. Shimmery. Typical, like, yeah. Not metallic. Yes. Uh, creme brulee. So everything is like a Christmassy. Yeah, that's actually quite a good idea. I mean, it's September, but like we're all preparing for Christmas already. We're just going to start Advent calendar soon, and you know, and this one I think sugar plum. Sugar plum. Oh my God! Who oh, made those? Okay, so what do you think? Average? Average, yeah, I mean this is, these are like normal lip gloss. I mean, I do, honestly, I do like to have like those like... Um, In your back or something. Yeah, and also Candy. I do like to put them on top of my lipstick when I do recordings because for some reason I've noticed that if you have like a matte lipstick on the camera, it just doesn't really look so good when you talk. Mm. Maybe because, you it know... It dry. Yeah. So I do like to put like something on top. Uh, the red one, I'm not sure. Maybe I can just put this on top of a red lipstick. If I have red lipstick, then and just put like, it on top of like it gloss, to get a gloss. Yeah. Maybe. But yeah, for an extra gloss, they're okay. Uh, but uh, so those, is it, those are like testers or just like a full I think, product? I think it's a full product. I think it's like a full, full product. You can actually get like a set of these. Okay, um, it looks like a tiny advent calendar, but nothing, I think, for my opinion, it's nothing exciting. Just like a typical reddish, more like an orangey yeah. color. Then we've got like a, they're not even metallic, they're more like a shimmery yeah. glosses. I would say they're more toppers than, yeah. than lip glosses even. Yeah. I mean, quite cool idea that you have like four of these and quite cool that they actually have like the Christmassy names Theme. and everything. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, but in general, yeah, they're just okay. Just okay. Yeah. Okay. So what do you think Was of this box? Yeah, that's everything. Mm -hmm. Four products. No. Yeah. This one was quite cool, right? Yeah. This one was quite cool. The only cool. thing I liked was the eyeshadow. Oh, yeah. The eyeshadow. Eyeshadow and the bronzer. Yes. From my the Jacobs. Bronzer was nice. Well, the, the, the and, nurse. Yeah. Yeah. Well, well, in general, just in general, just in general yeah. the box was like. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm disappointed. <laughs> okay. 
Okay, so just let's get to the next one. Let's get to the next one. So we've got cohorted and it's so heavy. It will kill someone. <laughs> Anyway, so there's one thing you need to know before we open it. Okay. Uh, this one is a collaboration with Color Wow. So uh, it's a little bit different than last time because there's going to be only products from this one brand. And Cohorted actually does it. Every like three or four months they do collaboration with one brand. And then you have on products only from one brand. So mm -hmm. we'll see what you think about this one. Right. So is it like a specific brand? Is it like what? Color Wow. That's the brand. Okay. So I don't know that brand. That's like a hair brand, and I w I'll mention that this box value, this box's value is one hundred and twenty-seven pounds. And you paid forty pounds, thirty-nine ninety-nine. Thirty-nine ninety-nine. Okay, box same as usual. Uh, the inside feeling is the same as usual. It's so heavy, black and elegant. Yeah. Right. So let's open it. Nice secret at the front and some. Paper feeling, so you're gonna use it for Christmas presents for someone. For sure. For yeah. sure. Mm -hmm. I've got loads at home as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Right. So. Actually, make everything look more full and yeah, like, you just like, give a present. That's, Ooh, that's cool. so that's nice. Yeah. Bougie, bougie, <laughs> bougie, bougie. Right. So everything is for hair, right? Yes. Okay. Uh, raise the root. Okay. Let me just find it now. Um, raise the root. You've got long hair. You gotta use it. Raise the root. It's uh, next so doing like an extra volume. Thicken plus lift spray. Oh yeah, yeah. It's lifting your hair from the roots. Yeah. yeah. And this is worth nineteen pounds. And it says spray onto damp or dry hair, concentrating on the roots. Uh, typical root lift sprays are hardening resin. Use hardening resins that make a hard, stiff, brittle, and prone to. Okay, so this one actually like uh, raises. Okay, I was just. I don't think it smells nice. I mean, no, no, it smells like alcohol. Yeah, it smells like it. It smells like um those like uh hand cleansing gels, you know, very like people. Yeah, but it smells like very um hair, hair salon theme. Yeah. Anyway, this should actually lift your uh hair at like roots in this root area, but it doesn't. It shouldn't make them like stiff or hard or anything like that, which is quite good. In general, have you used this brand before? I have used one product. Uh, we're going to see if it's there or not, but uh, yeah, this uh, this particular one might be actually something that I would like. I don't really style my hair too much, but if I do, uh, this shouldn't really take too much time to do it because you just you know spray it on your hair and it kind of makes your hair more like thick or something. Like and it's made in UK. That's cool. Yeah, cool. Yes. So this is a UK UK brand. I guess yes. I think it is. Cool. Right. Let's go with the next one. I like the packaging. Everything is like fully packed. I, would, <laughs> I wouldn't like even know that for some price like this, like forty pounds, yeah. you can get like really, really full box. Yeah, and full sizes. You and know, full it's sizes. Not, like, not like you know, like a like tiny whatever. Right. The next one is extra mystical shine spray. Yes. Get lit plus kept dark forces at bay. And this one is worth £25 and it says that uh, this is the first super light glossing mist that works like an UV powered spotlight on your style. Oh wow, sounds nice. So, so this is like a, those like styling uh, hair oils that will just make your hair look uh, nice and shiny but it's not an oily spray so yeah, even less messy, that's good. <laughs> Ooh, it... Uh, blah, blah, blah. Color wall extra absorbs UV rays and releases full spectrum white light, acting like a solar powered spotlight on your hair. Oh, so your hair is gonna look very shiny. And I like... need to try it on like the next video. If my hair shines like a, crazy, did, then then the. Did you ever curl your hair? I do that, but occasionally because in UK with like a um, quite um, humid um, weather weather here, uh, whenever I curl my hair, it just ends up being straight after like an hour or two. So I can just curl my hair for the purpose of like one video or something, but if I go out, it's just like a waste of time. Because, okay, you know, try to do it maybe for the next video yeah. and use this. Um, yeah. I'm wondering how shiny it's yeah, going to yeah, be. Yeah, I'm going this to is, try. It sounds very cool. Like, wow. That sounds like actually quite interesting. Yeah. I'm not like a massive um, fan of styling products because like, you know, I you don't, don't really spend style. Time for this. But these two so far, like, they seem quite interesting. You know, mm -hmm. something that lifts your hair at the roots may actually be, you know, that doesn't really seem like much fuss, you know, you just spray it and like kind of, yeah dry it and then the other one like actually makes your hair shiny they, I, i'm wondering do they do like a dry shampoo because loads of women are like oh my god i'm in a rush i'm going for a date after yeah. work i need like a dry shampoo or something to lift my hair up They're like 
Yeah. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Maybe they're going to have heat it's over here. Uh, wow. The next one. Wow. 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 Dream filler for picture perfect color. Pre shampoo yeah. mineral remover. That's the product I actually tried. Uh, this is uh, something that's supposed to give you like a nice um, hair color. Um, like, you know, it just improve your hair color or something because uh, it kind of removes the minerals from the water or something. You just spray it before, uh, before washing your hair. Uh, just leave it for like one or three minutes, one to three minutes, and then just wash your hair normally. To be honest, for my hair, it doesn't work. Maybe I've because you've got dark hair. Yeah, probably because I've seen some pictures and that, that looked actually cool. But like most of those, those girls were like, you know, blonde or like, you know, like, like light brown. With my hair, I don't really see much difference, to be honest. Uh, so this is the one that I'm not too happy about, but maybe I'll just, you know, I'll be able to give it as a gift to someone who cool. is blonde. Dream filler, ideal for hair, all hair types and color shades. Mm -hmm. I don't know. <laughs> it doesn't really, I don't really see much difference, honestly, in my hair. And this is worth? 25 pounds. Yes. Let's get the next one. This looks... Tempting, pop and lock, high gloss finish, high gloss finish, okay. Pop and lock, yeah. This is frizz control and glossing serum. Uh, and this is worth 19 pounds. It looks glossy in the packaging. It looks, yeah, it looks like a, it looks glossy actually. <laughs> Quite cool. So yeah, open that, it, we'll see. What does it do? Uh, it's loaded with relubricating humectant. 75% of the formula works inside the hair to help restore elasticity and suppleness. Then the serum portion of the formula wraps around the outside of the hair, uh, forming a crystal clear high gloss uh, sheet to lock down the cuticle and lock in the lubricants. Hair color pops, texture is transformed. That sounds cool. That's something like very, that sounds like something very hydrating uh, and, you know, how does it feel? Mm, hydrating. Hydrating. Okay, that's good. I mean, <laughs> it smells hydrating as well. It does. It does. It smells like I like a cucumber or something. Something like very like watery, I think, or melon. 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 Yeah. Melon so, water fresh. So yeah, that 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 would be just the type of scent you would actually associate with something very like watery and hydrating. So yeah. I think it will be hydrating because it looks yeah. like a hydrating cream. Nice. That's cool. Cool thing. And what's the price for this? Uh, 19, 19 pounds. pounds. It's good for long hair because you know if you have long hair usually uh, the ends are dry because there's like not enough nutrition from like uh, from you know the uh, conditioner the follicles yeah oh yeah so it can't really be yeah so you get like the ends are usually drier than like the top roots. of the hair roots so yeah right oh my god lots of hair products okay the big one color security conditioner Conditioner 1950, that's the price of this product. And uh, da, da, da. usually conditioners are in big pockets. But, 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 yeah. uh, but that's actually quite cool because, like, conditioner, uh, I'm guessing the last one will be shampoo. Am I guessing right? Yeah. Because that kind of yeah. makes sense, right? Color yes. security shampoo. Okay, so this is like a set. A set. So this is, both of them are 19 pounds 50. This, the, both, both of them are 250 mils. And yeah, I mean, this is a this is always like handy, right? It's always good to have a shampoo and conditioner, so I don't mind. Um, what does it say anything interesting about it? It's not so expensive, 1950. Yeah. Uh, it's, it's uniquely formulated without any typical film forming ingredients uh, found in most shampoos. Okay, that's what makes it unique apparently. And about the conditioner, it says that typical conditioners have ingredients that can make the color look dark, distorted or brassy. Color Wow's Color Security Conditioner is uniquely formulated with six translucent conditioning agents that won't oxidize corrupt color or turn in brassy, providing ideal detangling and hydration for all hair types. That sounds actually good for like if you have colored hair, that sounds like a really good set to have. Yeah, it does. And it's one brand, so yeah. not mixing brands. 1950 for each product. Yeah. And it's a lot. 250 mil. Yeah. So what do you think in general about this box? Not for me. Not for you. Yeah, I mean, obviously. Just, just for hair. Okay. So just like, uh, yeah. What I have to say is this is 
always the risk with collaboration boxes because you know for me this box is actually quite good uh, apart from the one product that doesn't really give me Which much result yeah but the other ones even though they're styling they're like not for like specifically for, for curly hair or something like that so this is, uh, sounds like something that i might actually use like all of these products pretty much apart from the one sorry uh so but yeah if you have short hair or if you have like a i don't know different type of hair um or maybe not colored even these products might not be for you i mean you might not enjoy so them risk. that much so it's always a risk yeah um but you're always gonna like do a giveaway or, or sell true. it because come on like you're paying 40 pounds and you get like a full full size products in the box and it's like that's actually wow. quite good but like if you just buy it for yourself just as a, you know as a, like a monthly treat or something then uh this has to be like something you could use because you know that would be probably something that you could just give away as a present yeah or give or it as a present yeah, yeah. <coughs> definitely i would use a shampoo and conditioner and i would try this was the, was it the spray the, the glowy uv oh stuff? Yeah, yeah yeah that one that if i would have long yeah. hair or mm -hmm. even on the short hair i would even try to see yeah. if it does the maybe same maybe this one too because it's hydrating and I'm, I'm guessing if your hair is bleached you it, it probably yeah my skin is very dry because of the shampoo that i'm using but maybe this will like moisturize the scalp so but then better. again with the short hair uh you don't really need that much product on it so because it's just, it's just yeah and it also like you know if you just put too much on your hair it can just make it look heavy or something and you know you just have it like all the time probably so yeah in general i do like this box but it's not for everyone that's for sure yeah <laughs> and it's a it's a risk when you're getting the products yeah. when it's like a collaboration time yeah but i i think i think it's worth it i think yeah, it's worth 40 definitely, pounds definitely. to get all the products if the quality is good i mean yeah why not? I'm going to try and uh, see for myself. Um, try to get this UV thingy spray yeah. for the next video. For the next video, yeah, I'm going to do that for sure. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that's everything. These are uh, the two boxes that we unboxed today. Uh, what do you think? I don't know what the other one is. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so what do you think, Arthur? Mm. Not super impressed. I'm not well. super impressed like mm. the last time. Okay. I mean, like, you know, Cohorted is, uh, the collaboration is not my thingy this yeah. time, yeah. but maybe it's going to be good for you, for you, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah. worth trying, because this is something, I don't know, the, I don't know the brand, so maybe the products uh -huh. are really good, so maybe I'll be convinced while trying the yeah. product, and, uh, go look incredible. Look incredible, it was okay, it was nothing, okay, but like, nothing, like, spectacular, nothing, nothing spectacular, nothing wow, some of the bits and bobs are cool. Um, we would probably both prefer to find like a palette here or something yeah, like that. Yeah, something, something like, you know, nice. and to get dirty. Poof, <laughs> 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 <Oof, laughs> get dirty. But it's like a, like a little bit of teaser of what's coming next, yeah. which is before Hall like after Halloween, Christmas. Yeah. So, yeah. like an advent calendar theme Yeah, stuff. yeah, yeah, advent calendars are starting soon and um, we're going to do some advent calendars together too, can't so wait. don't worry. Can't wait. Can't wait. <laughs> I'm always planning to get an advent calendar for myself mm -hmm. and just do, op like opening every, every, every box every day, but I'm like, oh, it's like the end of December, I didn't got a calendar today. <laughs> so, I hope my boyfriend is going to buy me an advent calendar. Yeah. Maybe you should like choose one and like keep it open on your like browser so that he can actually see. Oh, I've been calendar day. Oh, this is nice. Yeah. This is so nice. Oh, I would love to get Ooh. one like this. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> Maybe you watch this video. And Maybe. Maybe. Watch the video. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, what do you guys think? Uh, what do you think of, of collaborations, uh, especially that type of collaboration that kind of like uh, it's quite. Uh, uh, exclusive because you kind of have to have long hair uh, to enjoy this uh, and what do you think of Look Incredible box? Uh, did you like the product? What do you think of the Yves Saint Laurent um, purse or whatever that was? The pink one? The pink shade? One. Shade is quite crazy. Bitchy pink. Bitchy pink. Yeah, um, yeah. I would love to hear your thoughts so please leave the comments below uh and uh thank you very much for watching thank you arthur for coming you're welcome <laughs> please remember to subscribe to our channel and uh have a look on arthur's uh instagram and his facebook uh for you know for some inspiration uh <laughs> and stuff uh and yeah we're going to see you soon uh
probably in some advent calendar unboxing. Yeah. Oh, are we doing some drinking as well? We are going to do some drinking advent calendar. So this is going to be a long video. Yes. I mean, it's going to be very <laughs> interesting. Moisturizing, moisturizing video. Moisturizing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm yeah. going to be so moistured. <laughs> okay, so. <laughs> inside and outside so that's everything in this episode yes. guys thank you again for watching leave us a thumbs up leave us some comments and let's let's, let's drink